Well, Kerry Price certainly can feel the burn right now because this has been so atypical to see from Kerry Price. 3 0 2 record in January, a sub 900 save percentage. February was particularly dismal, 880. Now, March, only the one start, of course, but. Oftentimes, Ryan, maybe we focus too much on goalies, put too much of the fortunes or the blame on them. But I don't think it's overstating to say Montreal has gotten subpar play from Carey Price, and someone clearly in this instance had to pay the piper. That was their goaltending coach. Absolutely. And as Mark Bergeron said, you know, you needed to change your voice. I mean, obviously, it's kind of shocking because you don't see too many times where a goalie coach you know, gets the ax. But, I mean, like a head coach, like an assistant coach, sometimes that voice can grow old and you need new ideas, um, you know, new ways to, to get to Carey Price and help him with his game. And they felt like they needed to move to, to give him that little bit of boost. I mean, he's, he's still Carey Price. He's just got to gotta find that game again. Yeah, he, he does. I feel like I'm working on T, TMZ today. Yeah. <laughs> we got all kinds of backstories. And <laughs> well, my, heart's in the right, my heart's in the right place. This is what happened. <laughs> Stefan Waite was let go in the middle of the game, <laughs> right, apparently. Terrible, yeah, terrible news. <laughs> it has been the craziest of years. What can you say? But at the end of the day, I know Sean Burke. He used to be a client in the firm I worked at, Octagon. Nice. He's a very, very intense guy. Mm -hmm. That is the good news. The bad news, of course, is we pointed out in our meetings, he can't get there for two weeks. Quarantine, unbelievable. Yeah, so we're going to go Zoom coaching until then. <laughs> but uh, ultimately, my takeaway from this situation is it's very strong in that, yes, the fortunes of the Montreal Canadiens will go through Carey Price. If they want to stay in the playoffs, Jake Allen's been sensational, done everything you could ask of him coming in. But they're going to need Carey Price to be the Carey Price that showed up last year, got him through the play-in round, and was sensational in the next round after that. If they get that, then forget it for the Canadians. They definitely will be in the playoffs. That seems like mission one. Uh, can they go farther than that? Again, it would rely, in my opinion, not exclusively, but primarily on Carey Price's back. And you're right, Jake Allen has stepped up, as those numbers indicate. But, Ryan, you've seen this before, played with the Henrik Lundqvist. Like, it is tough sometimes. I don't think Carey Price is quite there yet. But my point is, he's been subpar for enough of a stretch right now. I don't think they're going to ride Jake Allen. But to Lotz's point, a lot of this is on Carey Price, rightly or wrongly. He's getting paid a lot of money. He has to help to try to turn this around. Yeah, and you said Henrik Lundqvist. I remember playing with him, and he'd go through some stretches where he wasn't playing up to, you know, Henrik Lundqvist standards. And right. What he used to do is he used to take a week off or five days off, and with goalie coach Benoit Lair there in New York, one of the best goalie coaches and guys that uh, I've been around, he would work on his stuff. He'd work on his, his grind positioning. He'd grind it out. He'd figure out what was going on, and then when he came back, he was back to being Henrik Lundqvist, the king, you know. Yeah. So it's tough in a season like this right now for Carey Price. I mean, you don't have that luxury, right? You don't have the luxury of missing four games, five games to to figure out, you know, what's going on. It's it's a shortened season. So um, for me, I think Carey Price needs to take some time that he did that, look good last game. Uh, so hopefully he can continue to riot lots. Yeah, I agree. Kelly, you and I would be terrible on TMZ. But <laughs> be awesome. I'd have no problem just throwing that dirt around there. We'll make put the resume together.